طلاب العربية طالبات العربية أهلا وسهلا بكم من جديد في الدرس الرابع عشر من المنحة درسنا اليوم المضارع المرفوع تذكروا يا طلابي قلنا المضارع من ثلاثة أنواع المرفوع الدروس والمنصوب الدروس ينتهي بالفتح والمجزوم الدرس ينتهي بالسكون اليوم سنركز على المرفوع المضارع المرفوع وهذه صيغته Now look at the form and how we conjugate المضارع المرفوع المخاطب المخاطب الغائب المفرد المثنى والجمع وسنأخذ فعل كتب Let's take the verb كتب and conjugate it through the pronouns But notice before we start that The present tense, unlike the past tense, is using a prefix and a suffix as modes in which you fit the conjugations. Notice there's a prefix and there's a suffix in most of these cases. So, أنا أكتب نحن نكتب أنت تكتب أنت تكتبين أنتما تكتبان أنتم تكتبون وأنتن تكتبن Notice the sukoon before the noon with the fatha هو يكتب هي تكتب هما يكتبان هما the feminine تكتبان هم يكتبون وهن يكتبن If you look very carefully you see that the first person is slightly different However, the second person has a ta in common as a prefix, and the third person has a ya in common as a prefix. The endings are about whether you use the noon and how to use the noon, and it would be very interesting for you to remember these pronouns that do use the noon. Nafyu al mudari al marfu'al. Now, how do we negate al mudar al marfu'a? Nastamil la ma al mudar al marfu'a. La adhkurus maha. I do not remember her name. We can also use laysa, especially with af'alu al qulubi wa dhani wa al yaqini in the present tense. Lastu adhkurus maha. Now, ذكرة is one of the verbs of القلوب والظن واليقين and they tend to be mental verbs in general which we can negate with ليس in the beginning. A note, ملاحظة قد تنفي ما الفعل المضارع إذا كان الفاعل بصدده يعني we can also negate this verb, the present tense verb with ما if the subject is in the act or in the process of doing the verb. مثال هل تكتب السؤال here the question is الآن are you writing now not do you know how to write in general we can negate that and say ما أكتب which means I am not writing now let's talk about the function of المضارع المرفوع now how do we use it وظيفة المضارع المرفوع المضارع المرفوع can indicate three different things in time الزمن الحاضر the present tense أكتب رسالة لأختي I am writing a letter to my sister or I write a letter to my sister حقائق عامة general universal truths يقع المغرب في شمال أفريقيا Morocco is located in North Africa. المستقبل Now, تذكر Remember the sentence that I gave you when I talked about the two meanings of time. Tense and time. The present tense can indicate the future as well. نلتقي غدا إن شاء الله نلتقي is in المضارع المرفوع and in the present tense but obviously the sentence is saying we shall meet tomorrow. Shukran lakum marra ukra al antibahikum wa araakum bi ibn Allah.
في الدرس القادم